The dictionary definition of a pet is an animal kept for companionship and enjoyment. But we heavy petting people know that there's a lot more to them. They stand by us through every phase in life, through sickness and in health. And to appreciate this bond more, let's see what we've got lined up for you today. We'll be visiting an organization in aid of stray animals. We'll meet some healing paws. Your pet's photos are waiting to be featured in Blogger's Bark. Pet parents need not worry anymore, the vet is in. Our free roaming canines sure do have people they can depend on because there are several organizations that are working hard for them. I'm here today at WSD, which stands for Welfare of Stray Dogs. And this is a Mumbai-based NGO that works hard to eradicate rabies, control the street dog population through humane and scientific methods, and also, of course, along the way, help any injured or ill dogs. Let's find out what these people do exactly, and I'm going to check out the place too so you can join me. Well, I'd like you to meet Abode, who is the CEO of Welfare of Stray Dogs. Hi, Abode. Hi, hi. <laughs> nice to meet you. Welcome to WSD. Thank you so much. And tell me about WSD. How long has WSD been around? Well, WSD started in 1985. We actually pioneered the stray dog sterilization program. The, the place where you, we, we are right now used to be the killing pound of the BMC. And from 85 to 89, what we did was we used to rescue dogs, you know, uh, uh, pay a license fee and just take them and release them. Oh. And then in 1994, that's when the killing program stopped and then they gave, handed us the old kennel. Size of WSD? Uh, we have about 200 dogs at any point of time. Okay, in terms of and area though? In terms of area. And um, uh, out of these, about 100 come in for sterilization, so okay. they remain for, you for a week and go back. We have an on-site first aid program where we go out and treat dogs on the streets. Uh, where we have a helpline. We also have an adoption program. How does that adoption thing work for you? As far as the adoption program goes, it's not that a person wants to adopt a dog and says, yeah, I want a dog and here take it. You know, it's not as simple as that. Because one, we need to be sure that the dog is going to a good home. So we, um, as all the dogs are behaviorally assessed, we try and find out more information about the family. Well, you know what I've noticed also about your place, which I'm really, really liking a lot, is uh, you have huge rooms uh, and you have groups of dogs together and they are very packed animals. I mean, how did, I mean, that's wonderful. I love that you do that. And how do you work that? I mean, you have... Um, see, uh, if you look at WSD, and this is, this is an old pound that we inherited. Yeah. So we couldn't do much with the ventilation, etc. But we tried to do a lot by, of course, uh, keeping it clean. But other than that, um, uh, the sections we have are that uh, when a dog, when one lot of dogs come in, mm -hmm. they're put into a community kennel, mm -hmm. and because they are from the same area, the, the, they, they don't fight with each other and so on. Mm -hmm. 